He's away. Here goes the buzzer, makes a flying leap onto the first rope. There are five ropes. You don't necessarily have to touch all of them. What will he do? Hey, he's got great strength through the air, doesn't he? That's a really good start for him, Josh O'Sullivan, and now the eye beam gap. Uh, he is oh. moving at a furious pace. I think this is the fastest start we've seen so far tonight. Now the transfer. Josh is doing a great job time-wise. Now onto the salmon ladder to Unstable Bridge. One minute 30 on the clock. He needs to go up three levels. That's one, two, three. Josh O'Sullivan's looking good here, Beck. Unstable Bridge now. And that is a big swing. Oh! Oh, oh he's just banged his head on the Unstable Bridge. Bit of a hectic run from Josh O'Sullivan. Probably not what he was expecting, but he's still on the course and still moving. His time is fantastic. He is so much fitter than what we've seen in seasons one and two. He's gone away and done the hard work, and it is paying off in the grand final tonight. Now he's on the parallel pipes, and with 55 seconds left on the clock, 11 seconds faster than Daniel Mason. Whoa. This is the cat grab. Just doesn't want to fall to hit. Now going backwards on this. Interesting technique, making it a bit more difficult for himself. He's just so, so fast. Nine seconds ahead of the Barefoot Ninja. There's no stopping him. He's powering through these walls. Josh O'Sullivan. Yes. Shirt off. Buzzer pressed. And that is our fastest time of the night so far. You can't believe it. He cannot believe he is through to stage three. You deserve it, Josh O'Sullivan. You put in the hard work and you are there. Josh O'Sullivan and potentially a $100,000 run. Kicks off the Cannonball Alley. There are small balls and there are bigger balls. Generally, you can handle the smaller balls with one hand, but you need two hands for the bigger balls. And every obstacle in this course in Stage 3 is set up for maximum burn. He is nearly through the first obstacle. Now the body prop. Really important that you dry out the hands and the feet because this is all about sticking yourself in between those rails, if you like. This stage three course just tests everything about our athletes. It tests their mental strength, physical strength, and above all, how much they want this. Joshua Sullivan, look at that steely look, look at his eyes focusing on the heat, little movement with those hands. This obstacle is the toughest of all. It works your back, your core, your shoulders. You can't rush and the burn, well, it just builds and builds. We should make the point that these walls are adjusted based on the height of each ninja, so it's not like you have an advantage if you're taller. If you're taller. Here he goes, he's just starting the climb up the hill, which is so tough on your body. Imagine doing oh. a plank all day and all night. Yeah, this is just off the scale tough. He's going to... Oh, yes, yes, yes. He's through the body prop. Josh O'Sullivan. Take a breath, babe. Take a breath. Just stopping here. You might wonder why he's going so slowly. They'll win tonight if they're the furthest. This is about distance, not rushing. Yeah, time will only come into it if two ninjas reach exactly the same point, but they all know they need to go the distance. OK, Josh O'Sullivan on the cliffhanger. All the weight on his fingertip, but he's so strong, this bloke. See the bent arms, that's great control, but he's burning energy. Up he goes, and then down he goes again, making the transfer onto the second last board. Don't slip, Josh. Now he's going to turn his body around, lashé himself on to the last of the cliffhangers. Using that body, swinging across. Yes. Oh, he's there. Wow, Joshua Sullivan, the dream is still alive. Yes! Just two more obstacles between Josh and Mount Midoriyama. Australian Ninja Warrior has never been this close before. Floating doors next. They look simple, but it is diabolical because there's nothing to grip. You can only keep yourself up. 
by pinching the doors between your feet. And that is so, so hard. Come on, Joshy! Let's just let everyone know as well, as far as the rules are concerned, you can't use the top of the doors, only the sides. How do you do that? Let's find out. Come on, Josh. What? Josh O'Sullivan has fallen. Oh! What an incredible effort, though. The crowd upstanding for Josh.